Hey everybody. Hello everybody. Hey everybody. It's Brock. This is Brock. And we got a new episode with another episode of All About. Of All About. All About. What's up everybody? It's Brock and we got a brand new episode of All About today. Today we're going to be learning about the Copper Band Butterfly Fish. It's a very, very pretty one to get in the butterfly family. Prices you'll spend is about 50 bucks on them. Tank size, you'll need about a 55 gallon. Care level, he's moderate. The problem with them is they tend to be very, very picky eaters. A lot of times people have trouble getting them to eat and then they end up dying. So what we have to do with the shop is just one couple days, try to feed them some frozen cubes. He, all right, he didn't eat that, try to feed them flakes. Next day, try to feed them pellets and keep trying to do things like that. And anytime that we find aptages, we throw them in there for them because they are big time on eating aptages. Butterfly fish are really good about it, especially the ones with that long snout on them to get up in them holes and really peck them out. Temper, super peaceful angel. Reef compatible, I wouldn't recommend it just because he loves picking on stuff, so I'd really worry about him picking on your corals and stuff. So if you have one in a reef tank, definitely leave it down in the comments below. Let some other pinions run around, but up at the shop, we do not recommend it. Temperature, you want to keep it 72, 78, DKH, H of 12, pH 8.1 to 8.4, and your salinity 1.020 to 1.025. Diet, like I said, they are a carnivore. Max size, they can get up to 8 inches. You know, if they do start pushing this big of a size, then you might want to start upgrading your tank or change your rock structure to give him plenty of room to swim around while he's not too cramped. Compatibility, you know, just ask normally if someone gets a copper band we recommend not putting him with other butterfly fish i don't know why but they tend to fight each other so that's never good so normally try to just pick one butterfly and put him in your tank color is that nice white with the orange stripes on them there's no other fish like him origin they do come from all the way to, from australia but really he's super easy to take care of if you can get him to eat a lot of times at your fish store like ask them like have you seen this guy eat and what is he eating and then do the same thing they're doing because unless you just got a really bad aptasia problem you'll really run into him having a very finicky kind of eater and trying to get a diet that he likes so that's it for him put him in there if you got some aptasias they will knock them out quick hope you all have a good day make sure to like and subscribe check out my other episodes and i will see y'all later